recently emailed me claiming he got sick after eating at a Bay Area restaurant. After pulling the inspection records over the last year, we discovered something was crawling too close to the popular buffet. And it wasn't the first time. That's why it's tonight's Dirty Dining. Well, the food's so good. The fact it's too good. We eat too much. Mike Amoroso chows down at the Golden Corral on South Broad Street in Brooksville a couple times a week and couldn't believe what inspectors found near the buffet. Did you know that they've had a problem with roaches? No, I didn't. In May, inspectors saw several live and dead roaches on glue boards throughout the restaurant, including under the dessert case on the buffet. They also discovered more roaches on glue boards under the buffet grill station and near the kitchen sink in the dish room. Oh, I don't eat roaches. <laughs> <laughs> and it wasn't the first time this Golden Corral had issues with insects. According to a report in March, inspectors documented numerous live and dead roaches on glue boards under the buffet, steam tables, near the grill, and throughout the kitchen. It doesn't affect you. Roaches don't bother us, huh? <laughs> so are the insects gone? Hi. Are you the manager on duty? Yes, I am. I'm Wendy Ryan with ABC Action News. Okay. This general manager on duty, Keith Miller, says he's worked here for three years. I wanted to talk with you about your latest inspection reports from the state. You guys have had some issues with no the roaches. Everything, everything goes through our corporate headquarters. Miller quickly explained he could not discuss much about the current kitchen conditions, but inspectors had a lot to say in their reports. Over the last year, they found food at dangerous temperatures with poultry, raw hamburger, and pepperoni not hot or cold enough. And they discovered the dish machine not sanitizing properly during two different visits. I imagine you're aware of what the state has been finding here. Uh, you have to go through our corporate headquarters. But since this loyal customer is a regular, these reports won't change his eating habits. Yeah, I think it's clean as any good restaurant around here. Then you'll be back? Oh, yeah. Now, I called Golden Corral's corporate office, and they sent me this written statement. It reads in part, quote, cleanliness and food safety are a top priority in our restaurants, and we work diligently to promptly resolve any issues that may arise. To see Golden Corral's full statement and other dirty dining stories, head to our website at abcactionnews.com slash dining. And if you have a tip on a dirty restaurant, head to my Facebook fan page under Wendy Ryan, WFTS, like my page, and send me a note. Jameson?